as you know, a, an extension of the Patriot Act recently uh, passed. It was uh, signed by automatic pen uh, while Barack Obama was in France. Um, and it's, I'm glad to see it's causing a little bit of alarm, uh, even among these established people. Here's the Los Angeles Times with this article. And they're talking about senators, two senators, who are sounding an alarm over the Patriot Act extension. Uh, one of them is Senator Ron Wyden of Oregon, and the other is Mark Udall of Colorado. So, first of all, thank you very much. Um, both of these guys serve on the Intelligence Committee. And again, they're senators. They're not, you know, these goofball uh, representatives who could be, you know, well, we got one right now in, in uh, New York who <laughs> sends pictures of his dick to uh, random women uh, via Twitter. These are senators, and hopefully they don't do stuff uh, that stupid. Um, but anyway, um, going to the case here, this is quite, quite serious. Uh, today, and here's what Wyden says, today the American people do not know how their government interprets the language of the Patriot Act. Uh, someday they're going to find out and a lot of them are going to be stunned. Uh, some of them will undoubtedly ask their senators, did you know what this law actually did? Why didn't you know? Wasn't it your job to know before you voted on it? And that's coming from a senator on the Intelligence Committee. Uh, that's uh, Wyden. And then y Udall uh, said he wasn't allowed to discuss any of the details uh, about what he knew about the bill with his fellow senators unless they went to a secure room in the Capitol designed to uh, thwart eavesdropping. Now, now, what kind of lawmaking is this? Um, in a statement before the vote, here's what you all said. Uh, it allows the government, the new Patriot Act, the new extended Patriot Act, uh, to place wide-ranging wiretaps on Americans without even identifying the target or location of such surveillance. Uh, it allows the government to target individuals who have no connection to terrorist organizations. Uh, it allows them to collect business records on law-abiding Americans who don't have any connection to terrorism. So what is this uh, Patriot Act all about uh, if it's not targeting terrorists? Well, it seems to be targeting uh, people who have businesses and have money. Well, we are about, uh, we're on the precipice of the whole financial system completely collapsing. And uh, one of the ways the government is going to try to get themselves out of this, uh, of course, is through taxation. So do not be surprised if this Patriot Act, which was uh, created, uh, by the way, it was written by Michael Chertoff. <laughs> been through the airports lately, uh, been forced to go through a full body uh, scanner uh, or groped. Uh, that was Michael Chertoff's doing, and so was the Patriot Act. And this thing appeared full blown immediately after 9-11, and everybody uh, without reading it voted for it. And now here we are, nearly 10 years later, and we have two senators on the Intelligence Committee, to their credit, uh, pointing out that the stuff that the government is using uh, this bill to justify is literally hair-raising. And my guess is it is going to be used to uh, search and destroy uh, any American who still has any wealth left after um, the Fed and a handful of banks and the uh, bush Obama, that's uh, George Bush, Barack Obama administration have totally uh, destroyed our financial system and economy. So um, hats off to Senator Wyden and to uh, Senator Udall and uh, I guess thanks to the uh, usually uh, CIA ridden LA Times to actually write something of use uh, in their uh, fish wrapper of a newspaper. I, I guess even a broken clock is right twice a day. But this is really serious. Uh, if you've got a senator, you might ask him to pay attention. Uh, you know, it's getting to the point where it's just one uh, absurdly uh, appalling thing after another, but at, le at least this one made it to the news.